welcome back to legal ways in this video we will be discussing regarding some important questions which can be asked from indian constitution indian constitution is one subject in which every law student should have a court grip on so in this video we will be discussing about certain questions which can be asked in an interview if you are giving an interview for an internship or for a job few simple questions can be asked which we think is not that important like in our indian constitution how many articles are there you should know that how many articles are there how many parts are there how many schedules are there so there are 448 articles 12 parts and 12 schedules and when it come to amendments that how many times are indian constitution is amended it is like 100 plus times and like we don't know when the next amendment can come yeah so the next question can be asked is who is like known as court father of indian constitution so it is b r ambedkar the next question can be put upon regarding when did indian constitution came into effect and when it was adopted as these are two different dates so it is to be remembered that indian constitution was adopted on 26 november 1949 whereas it came into effect on 26 january 1950 the year is important here to remember the next question that can be asked is what time it was taken to get indian constitution ready so the answer for this question is the time taken for indian constitution to get ready was 2 years 11 month and 18 days to kya kya protections provided hain in our indian constitution with respect to conviction so there are three provisions provided in the article 20 the first one is ex post facto law which means there shall be no retrospective effect if we understand by example so when the offense is committed and there is law for the same then the person shall be convicted but when the crime was done and there was no law for the same and the law was made later so for the of so for the offense which was done prior to the law made then the person shall not be liable as it shall not have an retrospective effect otherwise in the case provided the second point is double jeopardy which means that no person can be convicted more than once for the same offense the third one is self incrimination which means that no person can be compelled to be witness in his own case so the other question which can be asked can be related to a hot topic that is article 370 as the as we know that article 370 has been revoked and it primarily gave special status to jammu and kashmir so you should have a glimpse on the article 370 as it is a hot topic it can a question can be arose from this you should remember few fundamental rights and directive principle of state policies on your tips as their names can be asked as the right to equality is a fundamental right all our directive principles so few questions can be asked from this you should read about all the names of fundamental rights and dbsp and a next question related to that can be the difference between fundamental rights and dbsp the fundamental rights are enforceable and justifiable whereas dbsp are not and we, and it can be asked that what is the power of president it is very important to remember that there is few special power given to the president like but the power to pardon the power to military as he can declare the war the legislative power the executive power you should read that and remember that 
द नेक्स्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन इज रिलेटेड टू रेड्स यू नीड टू रिमेंबर द आर्टिकल एज वेल एंड इन दिस इट कैन बी आज द नेम ऑफ द रेड्स और वन रेड कैन बी स्पेसिफाइड एंड यू शैल बी आस्ड टू टेल डैट इन वट केस दिस रेड शैल बी इन फोर्स सो इट इज़ वेरी इम्पॉर्टेंट टू रिमेंबर द नेम ऑफ द रेड्स एज वेल एज देयर फंक्शन फॉर एग्जाम्पल द क्यू वर एंड टू रेड इज यूज टू आस अबाउट वट इज योर अथॉरिटी सो यू नीड टू रिमेंबर ऑल दीज these are few of the important questions related to indian constitution which can be asked in an interview as indian constitution is a common subject so no matter regarding which field you are applying for it these questions can be put upon you may tell me in the comment section as which other subject should i cover and tell the important questions for interview Uh thank you for this video i hope you like